Greetings and welcome to the Astronomy Picture of the Day podcast. Today's picture for June 6th of 2025 is titled NGC 6302, the Butterfly Nebula. So what do we see here? Well, here we see an example of a planetary nebula known by the common name of the Butterfly Nebula. And a planetary nebula is what happens at the end of the life of a star like our own sun. Its outer layers will expand outward, and in this case, because of the positioning in the shape of maybe a butterfly flying through space. At the same time, the inner core collapses down. So what's forming at the very center here, hidden by the dust, is a white dwarf star. Now that current object is extremely hot, even for a white dwarf, nearly a quarter of a million degrees. And it will quickly cool off over the next few tens of thousands of years, becoming a much lower temperature, maybe only a few tens of thousands of degrees. And it will remain that hot, but while it is so hot, it does emit a lot of ultraviolet light, and that ultraviolet light energizes the gases left around it. Now, those gases were one point the outer layers of the star, and they are now being expelled outward. So the star kind of separates at the end of its life. Most of the mass goes down into the core at the center and remains there, a white dwarf star about the size of Earth, but still having the mass of a star, whereas the outer layers are expelled outward into space. And when we see planetary nebulae, we see very different patterns with them. Some are just like rings or smoke uh, circles heading out into space, whereas others give more intricate patterns. And a lot of this probably ties into the exact nature of the star that is becoming the planetary nebula. Was it part of a binary system? Well, that could cause some changes in how things work. And what other material is around it? How much dusty disks are around that material that may inhibit the flow in certain directions? So there's all sorts of things, but we do see all these different patterns when we look at various different nebulae. Now, here we can see the different filaments and knots as they expand outward over time. And we're looking at this in what is called a narrow band image looking very specifically at just two elements, and that would be ionized hydrogen, so hydrogen which has had its electron ripped off and is now recombining, and oxygen which has been ionized twice or had two of its eight electrons ripped off of it. That gives an idea of how much energy is around because it takes a lot of energy to ionize oxygen twice and to keep it ionized enough that we can actually see the various lines from that material. So by studying specifically the gas, we can highlight that. We're imaging primarily the gas, although of course we'll pick up other objects as well. But that allows us to study the outflow and get a better idea of what might be happening in this specific instance. So that was our picture of the day for June 6th of 2025. It was titled NGC 6302, the Butterfly Nebula. We'll be back again tomorrow for the next picture previewed to be Perseverance with Ingenuity. So we'll see what that is about tomorrow. And until then, have a great day, everyone, and I will see you in class.